Hi you guys, so I am back with another video for you guys today. I'm having coffee from the coffee club because I really need it. It's been a really long day for me. I'm gonna do a what's in my baby bag video for moms who, I guess, first time mom or new mom, you don't know what to pack in your bag or moms to be, you don't know what to pack in your baby bags and you're looking for ideas on what to put in your baby bag for when you're going out, this would be a good video for you just for ideas and pointers. You don't have to have exactly what I have in my bag, but it gives you a sort of an idea of what to pack and what not to pack. Because when I was pregnant, I was in that same position where I had to ask people, what do you put in your baby bag? What should I take with me? Everybody's needs are different. I had a few different ideas. Some, um, I okay, we got a little input from the little miss here. Um, some was a really great idea and some did not apply to my lifestyle. Hopefully it just gives you like a broad and general idea of what to pack in your baby bag. This is my baby bag. This is what it looks like. It's from Moschino Baby and I got this bag from Farfetch. It comes in a range of colors, but I was so in love with yellow when I was pregnant. I still love yellow, but I was just like obsessed with it when I was pregnant. So I had to get it in the yellow, especially for a baby bag. I wanted it to be like bright and lively. I thought yellow was the best color for me. So this is what it looks like. It's got this handle that you can put over the shoulder and it's got the longer strap here, which is also adjustable. And it's got the logo Moschino Baby and it's got the teddy bear and a bigger logo. I was gonna organize my bag before I do this video, but I thought it might not be as authentic if it's like well organized and all that. I just wanted it to be lived in so that we can like, you kind of like have an authentic idea of exactly what I use on a day-to-day -day basis. And we actually have just come home from going out. So this is what I have in this bag is literally what I use on a day-to-day -day basis. So I'm gonna start off with one corner. Um, I'm just gonna pull things out. So this is my wallet, my YSL wallet in one of the corners. I've got a headband. If you have a daughter, it's a no-brainer. You're gonna have like lots of headbands in your bag. And I've got a hand sanitizer. It's a dead old hand sanitizer. That's what it looks like. This is just your travel size. And I've got 20 cents, Australian dollars. I don't even use cash anymore, but I have this 20 cents. It's not focusing. This is just where I put my nappy stuff. So I've got two nappies, which I need to restock. And we're currently on size three huggies. And then I've got the nappy bag. It's essential when you're going out. You can use it for more than just like throwing out nappies. It's multi-purpose. I've got this. It's like, it's a newbie teething, um, biting thing. So when a baby is teething, they usually need something to bite down on cause their gum is like itchy and everything. It comes in this case um, for hygienic purposes. Um, but as you can see, it's got like, I don't know if you can see properly, but it's got like a mouth guard sort of shape and it's got teeth here around the bottom. That's for the gum. It helps clean the gum. And then this area here is for a handle to hold on to, but all areas of this, um, gummy bitey thing, the baby can bite. So it's all like squishy and it's all, um, it's not hard or anything it's really squishy and you can bite through it i also have another dead old hand sanitizer um i have got this little hair clip from seed it's a two-pack one i don't know where the other one is but this is just this one it's so cute it's like red i usually the other one that's not here i um plait her hair <laughs> Um, the longest part of her hair and just put this clip there like this just clip it on like that so i just have this in the bag just in case i forget i've got this hair tie this is for me it's this clear hair tie this is the only one that does not tug on my hair and it just slides off really easily i've got this phone charger this portable charger 
I've got this hairbrush. I barely use it, but I'm going to use it now. I don't like hairbrushes because I feel like they tug on my hair. I prefer to use combs rather than brushes. I've got a prescription here that we don't need anymore, but I've just left it in the bag. And I've got this 2023 diary. It was actually gifted to me for my birthday last year. I've got my phone in there, which like I said, we just went out. Um, so I just chucked my phone in there. I've got sunscreen, SPF 50. This is just to take around with us, just in case I forget to put sunscreen on at home. Um, I've got a toy. This is one of Surprise's favorite toys. It's multifunctional. This is actually one of the first toys that I got her. It's got like this propeller thing. It's got this one and she can buy it onto this one as well when she's teething. So I've got that in there. This is a fan stand. I'll find the fan for you. This is for like summertime. So it's this fan here, a portable fan. It's actually not charged, so I need to charge it. So I usually charge it and then chuck it in the bag. So this needs to be charged. You just pop it on like that and it stands. So this is for like summertime when it's like really hot. Right now it's winter, so it doesn't get that hot. Um, but yeah, like that comes in handy when it's like really hot. I've got this baby body lotion. I usually use it as just hand cream for myself, but like in case of anything, I can use it as a baby lotion and it's a vino. That's what it looks like. And then I've got this baby wipes. This is what I use. It's like a water wipe. I've got this stackable toys. We're not at the age yet where she can stack it. So she just plays with them individually. So they're all over the place. This is just one of the many that stack up. It's like an egg stack. And this is one of the smaller eggs. She loves playing with this. So we take this with us. I've got a few pairs of socks in here. Oh, look, we've got another hairband. This is the one that she wore today. I've got the socks. That's one pair. I have to find the other one for this. I can't find it. So we've got one sock here. I'm sure it's in the laundry somewhere. The other, the other one. What do you know? We have another headband. This one is from main, no, it's from Jamie K. One of my favorite brands to buy clothes for her. I don't know if you can see the brand, but that's what it looks like. It's super cute. It's like a peachy sort of color. I've got a nail filer for myself. I don't know if you can see that. Um, oh, there's the, there's the other foot of the sock that I had. So that's another pair. This is from her fruit toys. This is meant to be, I think a red onion or something like that. That's just one half of it. She loves eating this half pieces. Um, everything goes in the mouth right now. So that's where we are. I've got this feeding wipe handkerchief sort of thing. You just wipe any spillage while she's feeding. I've got this nursing cloth that I put over me when she's nursing and I also pop it on the pram if it gets too sunny. So we use this one and I pop it over her for blanket also. So it's very multi-purpose. And I've got this perfume that I use, I carry it with me. It's so pretty. I'm actually going to spray it right now. It smells so good. Okay, so I think that is everything that's in my baby bag right now. I need to clean it up again and get all these extra stuff out of there. But I just like the fact that this is a lived-in baby bag like sort of situation where it's not like an organized like start of the week sort of thing. Because usually in the beginning of the week I organize everything and then this is midweek where i've gone out a couple of times where like this is literally stuff that i use when i go out and stuff that like gets left in the bag and all of that crazy stuff i don't think there's anything more to add to this it's just like yeah this is the situation 
with the baby bag if anybody have any questions or anything or any comments just comment it down below and i'll try to reply or if it's a question that requires another video i'm happy to make a video answering it so thank you guys for watching and i will see you in my next video thank you bye Thank you.